Well, some relief tonight for students at an Austin ISD high school after the campus ran into a water outage problem today. We received several emails from concerned teachers and parents about the lack of water. Staff at Eastside Early College High School say the outage forced students to walk down the block to use the restroom. As KXAN's Jennifer Sanders tells us tonight, this all started this morning when Austin ISD says it discovered a large water main break. Brenda Benavidez says she received an alert Thursday afternoon about water issues and a main break at her son's school. So that is a big concern. Austin ISD sent this letter to families saying electrical and gas were still working, meaning lunch was still served. Temporary hand sinks, though, were set up for the kitchen staff. The district also delivered pallets of water and 20 portable toilets. Benavidez's son, Jose, says it only helped a little. I just really couldn't use the restroom and stuff and then like there's there's sometimes be a lot, lot of fire drills in the same day. An issue KXAN reported on about two weeks ago when students alerted us to false fire alarms saying there were at least 30 emergency drills since the fall. Austin ISD told us that the fire alarms are too sensitive and were being set off by fragrances and steam. AISD said it has corrected the design and is replacing them. <laughs> Parents and staff we spoke to Thursday say they are concerned about these issues, especially almost a year after the school received a fully modernized facility that serves both schools, all part of the 2017 bond program. Moms like Benavidez just hope the problems get fixed permanently. Hoping they don't have them in school if, you know, if there's no water. Austin ISD tells us crews have fixed the issue. We did start looking into this one after parents reached out to us. You can send us your tips. Always check out our website or use this QR code on your screen. Elson District allowed us inside the campus at the start of the school year to give us a look at this brand new building. Back then, parts of the building were still under construction. The district telling us the delay was because of back orders for equipment and unseasonable rains. The campus was built thanks to a $1 billion voter-approved bond in 2017. A big chunk, $146 million, went to this school. It features several modern upgrades, including labs that focus on STEM education and outdoor courtyard and learning spaces.